Yo, what's up everybody and welcome back to another episode of Rub Up Nostalgia. This is your boy, DG the Gamer. What's up y'all, Zamac here. And, and we are, oh my fault. And today we're playing Deception. And then we got... Uh, this is Desmond, yeah I'm just here. You know him. Um, anyway, we are back with another Mortal Kombat. So we did Shaolin Mux, now we're doing MK Deception. Conquest mode, something they should have brought back in MK12. <laughs> hey, which, which adds up to a disappointment. Yeah, man. Well, I mean, listen, great game, but yeah, could have been better. One of the best we are now you. in Conquest mode. This is the beginning of Mortal Kombat. Deception. Mortal Kombat Conquest! As we go to the village with the children, and we see them playing Mortal Kombat. We see Indie them. Indie Gardens! Playing, fighting, causing trouble, BSing. They getting down out there! Down and dirty. Oh! <laughs> that <laughs> man used a lot of. Is that a black man? <laughs> <laughs> Kinda got a little black in his voice. Yeah. Hold up! His mannerisms too. I thought that was a girl. That's a, that's Is a, it not? That's a guy. <laughs> he played that's Shang not. That's a chick. He oh, played okay. Shang Tsung. That's a little boy. That's Goro. That's a smart way of doing it. Yeah, two bald kids with ponytails in the back. I don't know what that dude over there is doing. Like the Notre Dame. <laughs> what is going Stop. on? Stop. <laughs> it's like they're making fun of Outworlders. Yeah. Hey. They are going to class. They are late. They must run. All the children must go back to the dojo. But not Shujinko. He goes to the special dojo. Who does he hear? Why is he standing like that? He does not know. But yeah, like I said, I do miss when this game is like all about Asian mythology. The master is always faster. Shichinko, you have arrived. Let us begin. You have a long way to go, but every step is a victory. How you maneuver in combat plays as much a part of your strategy as how you punch or kick. So guys, this is like tutorial mode, but then you go to the open world when you're finished with it. It's real quick, so watch this. Damn! That, we said quick, anything he moved like that? Yeah, man. Fast. Do not assume that offensiveness is always the correct path to victory. A hasty retreat can give you the space you need to plan your next attack. Man, oh, whoa, kick him in the stomach. Oh, ah, very good. Excellent day. All right. Ah, 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 ah. This is the training. Yeah. So I remember, I said, remember playing this back in the day, bro. Uh, yeah, 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 I remember, yeah, I remember that. I think we had it. We had the game when it I, came out. Tim had it. Uh, yeah. All the brother guys. Uh, Tim had it growing up. Yeah, yeah, T, uh, yeah, TG uh, 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 had it back in the day. Oh, like, this game has been out for like 19 and a half years now. Yep, almost. This is going to be the 20th year anniversary. Uh, I get paid to whoop my teacher's butt. Let's go! <laughs> and yeah, that's where Baracho's at his peak. Yeah, I think a lot of people hate on Baracho. I, I like him as a character a lot. He's pretty cool. Yeah. Shout even, out to Baracho, man. Yeah, like his character was forgettable on Deadly Lines, but it got oh, better. Uh, as I was saying, like, like, like Baracho's character. Dog, is this a Sonic the Hedgehog game? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> He's moving fast. I was about to say that Baracho was forgettable in Deadly Lines, but he, his character was written better at Deception. Yeah, he did come Oh, shoot. He did come back. All right. Let's Why go. is he clearing the, the running time? Like, oh, my <laughs> days. You must be Shujinko, the one Master Bo Baracho mentioned. I've seen you around And I thought Apep was a woman. You and your friends are always pretending to be famous warriors in that park over there. My name is Apep. It's Apep. Master Bo Baracho asked me to show you the other school where <laughs> he is. Desmond's face. If y'all could only Follow see his me. face. 
Yeah, and I just wish we had a face cam. Yeah. Let's start talking to some people. Well, hello there. You look like a nice young man. Please excuse me, but I have to go put my money in a safe place. Please don't run. And you just punched a grandma. Sorry, I had to. <laughs> I mean, she said she had money on her. Which means, you know, it's necessary. Here it is. This is another of Master of Oracho's classrooms. I think he's starting another lesson right now. You should go inside. I will wait for you out here. So what I'll do, I'll do the dojos, and then I will come back and do the like the side quests, like the, the fun stuff, and interact with the people of the village, and, you know, we'll go from there. I feel like they just shook up. And yeah, and this game has so many uh, <laughs> uh, training, uh, training <laughs> tutorial. <laughs> it did look like they was about to shake you. <laughs> so teach. It's crazy. Man, these combos are awesome. Huh. Huh. Yeah, yeah, it's a big improvement over Deadly Lines. I, I do miss like the old fight. Because these are real fighting styles. Mantis, Sumo. Like like the martial arts fighting style. That's what's missing nowadays. Yeah, I got Shaolin Fist. Pretty cool, man. I'm skipping because I already know. Huh. Like, like, like the selection of fighting style. It was such, it was such an awesome concept they ever, they ever introduced. Yep. And the 360, de 360 degree, the ZX is fighting. Yeah, and I do like it too. Yeah. Mantis. Come on, let's hurry up. Go to class, man. Who's oh, business? yeah. There, there's been some massive criticism that in Kaka's well that the voice acting was bad. Hey, man, you alright over here? Shujinko, can you help me? I ate too like, like, kimchi. See, this and voice acting is the same. Find medicine for the sick boy before 8 p.m. Anybody see this over here? Uh, I, 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 I go. Uh, my, my, my god. Uh, you, you have to go to the mother. Uh, that's by the clothing area. Yeah, I'll be back. It'll be alright. Oh! Did you just shoulder check a grandma? Hey, man. You got to. Here it is. Master Boraijo says you are interested in becoming a real warrior. If nope. you are going to be the best, nope. you will have to train hard. It is not easy, but it is worth it. Already all Go like this dude. watch the next lesson. I will wait for you. Alright, come on, let's hurry up. What, what, you feeling rushed? Nah, I don't feel rushed. Just trying to get the lessons over with, trying to show people my skills. So, Zaymac, what do you think of the, uh... What do you think they should do with the MK2 movie? A uh, Mortal Kombat 2 movie? Yeah. Uh, I, I will say this. Uh, uh, I, I say that bring, bring back the OG characters uh, from 3D era, like the right show. Yeah, I would like to see Barretto in the next movie. Uh, and played by the played by the uh, uh, the actor that was, that was in It Man too. Oh, Samo Samo Hung. Yeah. Uh, oh, very good. That would be a great uh, cast. I don't know if he'd be too old for the role or not, but I, I yeah, would yeah. like to see it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that his health is uh, stable. Oh, that's good. He needs stable health. Yeah. Who would you want to? So, who should be the main character in the second movie? Um, I I, I say, uh, probably Johnny Cage, uh, uh, Liu Kang and Kung Lao, and Sonya. So they should bring Kung Lao back to life. Yeah, because the way they killed off Kung Lao in a in a movie, it was so disrespectful and and and, and lame. Yeah, I, I think they did come out a disservice. It would be good to see him back. Des, have you watched the movie at all? Or? Uh, I mean, I've seen clips of it. Oh, okay. Talking about the new one? Yeah. The with the made-up character? Yeah, Cole. Uh, yeah, Cole. That guy. Yeah, yeah, they should, they should like, get rid of Cole Young in the second movie. You I don't care what anybody this. say. Cole Young is just too generic. I just can't take, take him seriously. He doesn't feel like a more comic character at all. I mean, it, again... They could have the just made class. him with yeah, an original friend. character. They could have done so much more, but, but I have no money. 
Yeah, yeah but I think Louis Tan could have been could have played as Ken Chi, not this Ko Young dude. Ken Chi? Yeah. Ken Chi would have been good. Oh. Right. Or or if not, maybe Keanu Reeves as Ken Chi. Keanu Reeves. Greetings, young man. If you have come yep. for the auction, please step inside. Yeah, I'll be back for the auction. It's so cool. I think it's, that's that's that house where you find that gold coin. Yep. All right, let's find some ham for the uh, for the guy. You are right. The guard at the bridge must be hungry. Please take this ham to him. Appreciate it. I should call the authorities on you. You need to be taught how to respect others. You should have punched me back. Punk. Guard is hungry. Ham. I love ham. Thank you very much. Is he going to pay me for the ham or is it free? I do not know what you said to the guard, but it worked. He is gone now and we can cross the bridge. Let us go to the next lesson. Alrighty, let's go. Yeah, the next lesson. Yeah, this is one of the perfect example why why the voice acting for the NPCs are so bad. Well, it's kind of also what we talked about. If MK12 incorporated this kind of open world thing, I mean, if the PS2 can do it, there's no excuse. Yeah. Like 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 that's that's what probably with modern yeah modern gaming nowadays on PS5. The problem is. That developers focus too much on good graphics just to make a perfect perfect game i think that's the more like a go ahead go ahead the, the, like the problem is when you make uh ps5 games with good graphics is a lack of content lack of identity diversity and innovation i think that's more of an mk mortal combat problem oh, very nice yeah not only just for mortal combat but um modern games in general even american western games <laughs> I would say especially with Mortal Kombat, because they they are a game, at least a fighting game, that is known for having a lot of content. That's why Tekken 8 blew it out the water, personally, in right. my opinion. Uh, I would say so. They just had more What elements. content does Tekken 8 got? It has all of the original soundtracks from Tekken 1 through 8. They brought back that dodgeball thing, and then the metal just ball, iron ball, and the dodgeball. The that's great. all one thing, which is volleyball. Right. So but you can't give it four things for that. I mean, <laughs> I mean, like, for, for, okay, real talk. From a content perspective, Tekken uh -huh. Eight doesn't have that much more. Uh, it's just that Tekken Eight is a better game. <laughs> I mean, yeah. as silly as, soon as it sounds, like it, it just has better gameplay. I feel like, it is the new Mortal Kombat. I agree. I mean, like, all the DLC characters, like, not to be whatever, it's just, like, a bunch of dudes, you know, it's like, I mean... Like Omni-Man, that's about it. Uh, like, you got two Superman types, <laughs> you couldn't mix that up, I don't know. Oh, who's the other Superman type, I forgot. Homeland. Oh. You ever watch The Boys? The Boys? No, uh, nope, never watched it. Mm. <clears throat> and, it's, and it's also Peacemaker. Yeah, he's like a... Uh, he's kind of like a Punisher kind of guy, Care like from a fighting perspective. Mm. But yeah, I mean, I feel like the new Mortal Kombat is just with all the Hollywood stuff. Yeah, the Tekken Eight is that's what I was ultimately saying. Tekken Eight is just technically a better game. Right. It just is game fighting. The gameplay is great. Even the, the little bit of content, like they gave the fans what they wanted. They, they didn't tease them. They gave them the dodgeball back, the survival mode, man. That's what we need in MK. They don't, they actually don't have survival mode. They don't? Yeah, they also don't have team mode. Oh. So, that, that's what I'm saying, like, when it comes to, like, features and content, you know, it doesn't have that much, but, um, I feel like the problem with Mortal Kombat, they don't try to mix it up enough. Yeah. Like, they still doing the same story mode type over and over, where you play with one character for five matches, you beat some people up, then you play the next character. It's like, uh, can we do something else? Whereas like this, where the older MK yeah, games had some things that were mixed up. They had the conquest mode, this open world. It was on that man's ass. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, and also, when you look up reviews for Mortal Kombat 12, it's always mixed. The Earth Realm Academy of Martial Arts. And, and, and negative reception as well. Yeah. Fight School. This Fight is school. where students learn the more advanced techniques. Some of the best like, like, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest. 
Mm -hmm. Just because right now we're, we're watching this for the video. This tutorial is ass. <laughs> no, like, it's not like this is the this is in my opinion the worst way to do a tutorial, which is hey I'm gonna learn this one feature and then I'm gonna run over here, lecture you, do another feature, run over here like. There was so much. I'm giving it slack because it's an older game, yeah. but there are such better ways to do a tutorial than this. Well, uh, that's how he starts off in the beginning. Yeah. I just think in a new Mortal Kombat game, I'm gonna be honest. From a fighting game, I don't need open world. The point of a fighting game for me is to fight. Games. I do not want to be playing an adventure game in my fighting game. That's dope, but, though. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Awesome. Is it? <laughs> yeah, we're gonna play another. We're, the next Con Quest. Do mode. you know how much time and commitment is taken to make that? When instead you could have just added a new. Like I think people would want more characters than a Con Quest mode. Mm -hmm. That's my personal opinion. Cause guess what? You wanna know one of the main reasons I did not buy the new Mortal Kombat? Was this? There's no Jade. There's no Aaron Black. None of my characters and, are in it. And I don't, I don't give two craps wow. about Aaron Black. Damn, he came for him. <laughs> well, it's not just. <laughs> You can, I, I want my characters. Where are my characters? But wouldn't you want to do play with your characters throughout the like this open world, explore their world and stuff? No, that's cool. That's the whole no. point. That's the <laughs> I whole want point. to fight. Niggas. That's all I want. Well, that's why one of the big things with like Super Smash Bros. is that they brought back every damn character that's ever been in the series, and people got hype. That's all people want is their characters in there. Yeah, and I, and, I, and I will say this, is that I think NetherRealm Studios needs to lose their license against WB Games. Oh, yes, yes, that's true. I agree with that, actually. I actually do. I, th I think they're being held back a little I, bit. Like, 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 like NetherRealm Studios and uh, WB Games, they need to be separated. Because I'd rather have smaller developers working on the game rather than l larger corporation. What is that woman in the back doing? Um, I will say... Even if you think about it, like, think about Reptile, right? Mm -hmm. Like, one of the biggest complaints people have is that his, his design sucks. But this dude came back with a great design. They mm -hmm. came back with him being able to turn into a Reptile, not just be it. I think people appreciated that a lot. But nobody said, man, I really wish I could use Reptile and run across the lands and fight strangers in straw hats. Nobody gives a shit. Yeah, they just want cool. a cool Reptile back. Well, That's yeah. all they want. But it's also People want to be able to use Goro and say, I am Goro. But when's the last time this nigga been playable? Uh, yeah, it's been a while. It's been some years. Damn. Mortal Kombat, I mean, Mortal Kombat X is where Goro is playable. But, to be fair, Mortal Kombat fans, we love the content as well. We want to see more content like this. Because this is the only time you get to really explore Mortal Kombat. Like, all the worlds and stuff. You get to... The, the homeland and you get to see where characters origin stories are from just by traveling I'm gonna need to ask you something how many Mortal Kombat games are out uh 12 plus okay so here's my thing if you're gonna do this I don't give a shit about people's homeland I don't care about the home upbringing whatever to me it's the same thing where like a Spider-Man movie every single time it's about oh man Uncle Ben gets killed of a great power without responsibility. Like, we done heard this story. We done seen this story. Let's go somewhere new. Like, they do the same timeline shit over and over. Like, do new stuff if you got the opportunity, baby. So, do new stuff with the story and incorporate yeah. that in the open world. Yeah, then I would, I would be kind of down if instead it's like, where did, where did Johnny Cage go to school? You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, do something new. Right, right. I agree. And, and, I, and I will say this, that even Ed Boon himself said that he wanted Mortal Kombat to, su to succeed, but the problem is the upper higher management, like WB, mm -hmm. they just like, they just like mess it up by rushing it. Yeah, the deadlines and all that stuff makes it hard for creatives to like, do their vision. Like, uh, like pre-ordering games and showing trailers. Like, 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 it's been a year. What the f***? <laughs> I'm sorry. The man popped the squad so fast. <laughs> I, I, I was about to say, it's been a year since Mortal Kombat 12 got announced, and it's st still missing something. They, they, well, go ahead, go ahead. Like, like they, they focus too much on life service, costumes, and, yep. and microtransactions. Yep. Like, nobody gets a crap about microtransactions. But I'm with you, Diz, we're saying the same thing, because mm -hmm. I would love to see 
Jade's parents, where she grew up, how she trained, what martial arts she trained in, how she trained. You want to know why we can't, though? Because she's not there. Exactly. You want to know why she's not there? Because the developers aren't doing it. Yep. You want to know why? Because... They, I'll, I'll give you the answer. Go ahead. They have a finite amount of... Did you be slugging people, dog? <laughs> they have a finite amount of resources that they can use to create games, and they have to allocate those resources accordingly. So if they got these Hollywood story modes in action, where they got cutscenes, they got all this happening, they can't use that time to, to delegate to anything else. If you ask me, we don't need a story mode, really. We, need an, we can do an arcade mode, and then just have a bunch of mini modes, like mini games and other stuff. Like, like Tekken. Yeah, like I think that's what Tekken did, right? Where it's like Tekken has a story mode, sure, but it's in the realm of like an arcade mode where you just but make, it, you do it, a fight. But it was somewhat filler when it comes to story mode of Tekken. Oh uh, yeah, but, Tekken's Tekken's problem is that none of the characters are important. So so that's what I'm saying. So that's where Tekken fails because yeah. only the Mishimas are important. Mortal Kombat, everybody, well at least now most, Cap, most people Cap. are important. Cat. Most people. Cat. Most people. Did you play the most recent Mortal Kombat story mode? I watched it. Okay, what did Johnny Cage do? He bought a new house and he helped uh, <laughs> he helped get the Tarkots out of Molina. Him How? Loud and ready. How? They got the uh, antidote from Shang So you're trying to say Molina does not have Tarkotin disease anymore? I ain't saying all that. So what the fuck did Johnny Cage do? <laughs> he helped out, man. You know what I mean? You got Here's a, here's, a, here's, a, here's a tip for you. If you're one of the first characters that you use in a Mortal Kombat story mode, you're not important. You're not important. Because by the structure of the story mode, you will never win a fight if you're not the usable character. So Johnny Cage will just never win a fight again because he was one of the first characters. His story mode fights was reenacting movie scenes. <laughs> He's not important. I mean... He did win a real fight, man. You gotta get that to him. Not after he was usable. He loses every fight, and then another character has to help him out. Because he's not the player character. But, I mean... You wanna know another pointless character? Who's that? Hot take. Hot take. Sub-Zero. You look like a nice young yeah, man. In that story mode, they fuck him. I agree. Like, whoa, well, they really fuck him. Right, yeah. Are you talking about Scorpion? Uh, nah, in the new one, Sub-Zero. They made him betray the group. But then, like, he loses every fight. Yeah. He, like, what was the point? The Scorpion at the upper hand. Smoke, another useless character. Yeah. In the story, for what reason is he there? I don't know. Well, he's a little player. Yeah, but he don't do nothing. And Asia got his own chapter, too. I agree. Yeah. And also, rest in peace to the voice actor playing Smoke in more Kombat 9. Oh, yeah, rest in peace. Yeah. Well, I mean, at least they get the shine. Tekken, nobody gets the shine. Nobody, like, Heihachi, Kazuya, Jin, and who else? Jun, his old mama wasn't even important. Like, come on, bro. Because she's dead? Well, she came back. No, she, she's still dead. No, she's not. She's dead. I just saw her. Where? In Tekken 8? Where? In Tekken 8? In the versus mode? The versus mode. You want to know why? Dude, come on, Doc. She's dead. No, man. Did she appear in the story mode alive? Uh, well, I thought so. Huh? Mm. I haven't played the story mode, so... There, there it is, folks. What? There it is. I'm just saying, man. She's dead. That's why she's not important. Or at least relevant. But at least with Mortal Kombat, they try to include everybody. Everybody's on a team. I'd rather you not bother if no. you're just going to not use them. Imagine this. Imagine you're a Sub-Zero fan. And you play that new Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Would you have rather, like, as a Jade fan, I'm at least happy she's not in it. <laughs> I mean, that she's not gonna get embarrassed like they embarrassed Sub Zero. Uh, so I think that's more of a developer thing. Isn't your name Shujinko? I have heard of you. Yeah, like I said, this. Like I said, Mortal Kombat 12, or Mortal Kombat 1, wherever I call it, 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 got, it got announced like a year ago. And it's still pretty disappointing. Why did you hit me? Just leave me alone. Fight back. Ah. No, your student sucked. And he stood his ground though, ten toes. You need to respect your elders. He didn't fall though. 
He did not fall. He, did. <laughs> he, he stood his ground. Out. He ate that one. <laughs> I swear. And his students are just... Oh, like, he walked back up on you. Okay, that one, he almost <laughs> lost his footing there. He didn't expect it. Oh, man. Hey, yeah, and what I say about modern games nowadays, they focus too much on DLC I content. They just spend, spend more money on that. Shell. Like pay to win stuff. You will never find me. Yeah, I mean, they, they should. They need to bounce it out. They do, they do need to balance it out. That is, so again, Mortal Kombat, I, I love how they include everybody. I wish they included Jade. Because they're still important characters. They still have a, a side that they're fighting on. It's just, Mortal Kombat's un, other problem is they don't utilize the great characters and even some of the new ones. Uh, Tekken 8 is, since the beginning of time, for like 30 years now, the Mishimas are always important, nobody else. But Mortal Kombat... They need two things. They need to incorporate characters and open world. We gotta explore, man. And, and factions. Yeah, just like, there's so much. Mortal Kombat, the, what was good about the later ones, even if you didn't like the gameplay, you still appreciated the um, the content. That's what matters. Yeah, while well, having good graphics, even though good graphics don't make a perfect game. Yeah, good graphics don't make a perfect game. I agree. And I'll be honest about the graphics thing. We're at that stage in game development where graphics can only improve so much. I think like art style and like uh, like artistic vision matters a lot more than graphics now. Yeah, yeah agreed. And they even swap personality for more comic characters like, like uh, Scorpion's had just became quite young, which doesn't make any sense, like... Yeah, that was dumb. Like, Hanzo and Sasha would always be Scorpion. Nothing else. Yeah, I think that switch-up was pretty whack. That that, that kind of ruined it. So then they, they had no choice but to make some zero or something. I mean, like... I get what they were going for. Like, they reset the timeline, so, like, they want people to not go in to the evil, bad, hatred side of things that they used to. What doesn't make sense is that they just flipped. Like, if you're going to not have Hanzo be, like, the Avenger-type person, then, like, you know, like, don't just give Sub-Zero a angry plot. Yeah. Like, it's, just, it's pretty pointless, but hey. Like, they could have made a cool dynamic if Sub-Zero and Scorpion are, are just legitimately cordial themselves. and friendly. Right. But, like, not mixing up the personalities they had previously. And that's where I have a problem with the timelines in Mortal Kombat because they mess those up too much. Especially since, like, low key, I feel like. I don't know that much about original Mortal Kombat, mm -hmm. but, like, Noob, before he's dead, isn't he, like, a bad Sub Zero already? Yeah, he was the original Sub Zero. Yeah, like, you didn't have to. Reset things per se, just use the previous Sub Zero instead. Yeah, use the original two brothers, older and younger. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to mention the problem with new Mortal Kombat is lack of diversity. Yeah? Well, diversity in what way? What do you mean? Like content? They took like, out like, Jade like, and like, uh, like variations and. Oh, he means that way. I thought you were talking about how they took out the two black characters. Yeah, we got but they got Tanya though. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm saying Tanya. Tanya's great. I'm, She's I'm, ugly I'm, though. I'm saying that that, that the, the diversity means of uh, variety, um, range, difference, and 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 as well as um, as well as mixtures. The <laughs> man is like 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 I said. That's that's that, like I said. That's the problem with modern games. It's like a diversity. Like like variety and stuff. Variety of content, you mean? Yes. And and characters. Hey man, I'm gonna be Okay, I'm gonna be as honest as I can. Do you leave this village ever? Yeah, we leave. I I'm just do a side quest. I, hoo, hoo, hoo. Hoo, hoo, hoo. This area is off limits. It's funny you can walk past him. Yeah, he's the weakest guard known to man, bro. Right. Just do a couple side quests real quick. Oh yeah, and and and, the, and that key that the kid gave you, I think I think it's the I think it's the house where it, where it's, where he sees so many coins. All right. 
Uh, let's keep running. I think I'm done with side quests for right now. Yeah, side quest is pretty repetitive in Deception. Like, even though it could be rewarding, it it is somewhat repetitive. Side quest. Let's take a break from side quest real quick. Let's go to class. Six in the morning. Seven in the morning. All right, sup, teach, sup, Sujinko. Let's go. And, and they should have brought back Baraicho in Mortal Kombat 2, 12. Yeah, man, they should have brought back Baraicho, man. Baraicho. They just keep letting go. Correct. What kind of weapon is that? Dantian Dog. Fresh. Like, like, I don't know why, uh, NRS and WB games are, this way, they're, they're way too stubborn to put in all the content in the game. I mean, if people buy it, then, like, what's the incentive for them? Mm. Yeah, yeah, with, with high price of, of games, like, like being scammed. All right, let's move forward from here. We gotta go to the village. I want to know... Hopefully when they bring Jade back, I want to know more about Jade's backstory. I think they did Katana disser Katana, hot take. Katana, I love Katana. I love you, Katana. But for the most part, she's been kind of boring. At least within the NRS timeline. The last 10 years, she hasn't been the most interesting character. Yeah, because they didn't focus too much on story. Excuse me. I am training to be the fastest man in all of Earthrealm. Would you have me train by racing me to the end of this street? There is a well, 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 that, that doesn't mean that Katana is the worst character. People love her. No, I say she's wrong. Oh, sh <laughs> Ah. He almost had me. Congratulations. You have defeated me. Uh, it seems I still have much training to do. Ooh. And what about Melina? My stomach is like steel. That did not even hurt. But it's because you blocked her with your arm dump. Yeah. <laughs> I like Melina. Melina's dope, man. They just need to show Jade more. Right. Like, in Mortal Kombat 11, it ate so poorly when Jade was, 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 was like... Having a romance, romance relationship with Koto Khan. That was kind of strange to me. And in Force, it makes no sense. There's, there's no backstory of, there's no backstory of Jade, uh, um, uh, having, having a romance with Koto Khan. I was like, what the hell? It makes no sense. Though to be fair, I mean, do any of the relationships in this game make sense? Yeah, Liu Kang and Katana. What but rapport not have they ever built? I mean, he he saves her, and then. They like they like each other. They they save the world together. They have a common interest. That's pretty original. Yeah. I just I like I don't think romance is Mortal Kombat's strong suit. Is all I'm I, saying. Well, yeah, I agree. All right, let's go to the story. Like like Jade should have had a better relationship, not not this Kotal Khan. What you got against Kotal Khan? He's a hero. Well, women love heroes. He's green, and she's black. <laughs> like what's the point? What's okay? In this world, those people exist. I don't think beauty standards are the same. <laughs> yeah, you might got a point. <laughs> Good. She Lord. wears green. Yeah, if anything, that's her favorite color. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm, 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 and he likes to bask in the sun. He loves melanin. <laughs> what are we I'm, talking about? That's crazy. I'm, I'm saying the problem with Kota Khan is that he's 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 portrayed as a jobber, a punching bag. What are you? Uh, not starting out. At least I don't think. Starting out, maybe not. Oh no. The only jobber is uh fucking Aaron Black. Dude loses every fight. Yeah, Aaron Black is useless. And Shinar. I thought he was from Red Dead Redemption, no lie. I thought he was a DLC character and then I learned he wasn't. Made me upset. Yeah, but like yeah, but like I said about Kodo, he's a, he's he's still a punching bag. Always gets defeated and and, and crap. Isn't he like a boss in MKX? Well, because that's why his introduction he's strong. But then in the next one, because they have to show he gets overthrown, he's weak. Mm. Basically, anyone who starts off as an antagonist, you're going to be a, like, uh, fucking Shao Kahn, the biggest fucking bitch in the entire series now. Even though he started out as, like, a big bad. Yeah. 
Yeah, but that's facts. He yeah. needed a whole DLC story just to come back. That's that man got killed in a tutorial. Like f- that dude's a whack. That's all bad. They did my boy show calls. Yeah, yeah. And another round timeline, especially about to come at eleven. That like they treat like they did Shao Kahn like dirty, like a like a like a dumbass brute. Yep. Thank you. I will. This man is a warlord. Why is he acting like a, a meathead? Yeah. It, like in the midway timeline, Shao Kahn, he, like Shao Kahn in the midway timeline, he was portrayed as a cunning and a intelligent a warlord that also shows some honor. You must fight the best. Like, 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 like I said, I just do, I just do miss Shao Kahn's personality in midway timeline. Yeah, I agree. Shao Kahn was represented much better. I mean, he was represented, he was okay in MK9. I think he was still pretty powerful but then they just dropped him off yeah like betraying as a dumbass brute I'm gonna be 100% honest with you guys who the hell is Sajinka he's a great he's a he was before Liu Kang he was supposed to be the original Liu Kang uh, prodigy young prodigy he wants to save the world very naive though Sounds awesome. very generic. I mean, yeah, but roll with it. But he also he also <laughs> fucked up everything Earth Round. He's the oldest character in Mortal Kombat that makes him interesting. What do you mean? Like uh, like 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 the old Kobe So you'll so you'll, you'll see you see that big uh, light that came across him. That was uh don't spoil it, bro. That was uh. Uh, a messenger of the elder gods and they came to him and they said hey man let's come save the world he's like okay cool any kid would do it so yes not me the fuck I want to go to sleep I mean it's generic so it works he wants to be a warrior man don't you want to be a they at least made him look not boring he's just a basic white dude he's Asian you know he don't there's no shot he's Asian he got an Asian name but he look like a white dude look at him look at him Wait until that loading screen come back up. That is a white man. All right. Look, Look how he swing. He's a white man. He don't know, <laughs> how, to, don't know how to fight. I mean, he's knocking people out. <laughs> Women. Nice. <laughs> he can love the man. <laughs> Dog, if I can hit someone square in his chest and he lift off his feet, I would feel so powerful. <laughs> that, no, exactly. That is wild. <laughs> Imagine hitting him square in the chest. With a right hook, and he flies off the ground. <laughs> oh my! And he's dazed in a pool of his own blood. Bloody nose and all. Well, I knocked everybody out in this town. Why are you bullying people? What? Okay, what are we doing? How long is this video? What the hell are you doing? It's fun, man. See? Nah, he's just knocking people. So the name of this chapter is knocking out. <laughs> exactly. That's what it's gonna be. <laughs> He should praise you knocked out the whole neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> See, he was looking back. No he was standing there looking at me. Thank you, Master Bull Rachel. Thank you, Master Bull Rachel. You show great potential. I, I would very much like to try. Yeah, See, man, his naivety is, is what's beautiful, man. That's what young teenagers are, very naive. Train me personally. I would be honored. But first, I have tasks. To complete outside the game. Not the problem. I train all but yeah, like I said, they just dropped the ball with Raichu. They, they, the they let him go because me they consider him the worst character. I will see well, there. they should bring him back to Yeah. Like, like, like Raichu, every 3D character deserves second chances. Absolutely. How many chances has this nigga had? I feel like he's been in a lot of games. Who, Raichu? Yeah, he's like the guy who throws up, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's been in a lot of games. He's been in, well, three, at least the new 3D ones. At been. least the ones I've played, he's always in them. He's only been in three of them so far. He was in the... I feel like people just don't like fat characters. Because, like, in Tekken, all the fat characters nobody likes either. Like Gonryu? Yeah, and Bob. But, oh, Bob. Well, Bob is a slob, so that makes sense. How? Because he's fat. And Gonryu isn't? He's a sumo wrestler. That's the and thing. And Bob got fat to learn how to fight better. How does yes, that work? If he handicapped himself, he wanted to make sure he could still fight. And he was still about that action, even though he was fat. He used to be skinny. He purposely got fat to test himself. 
Well, so I can see why people don't like Bob already. But Gun Ryu is an actual sumo wrestler. Okay. And he's pure muscle. Not and all fat. he... Pure mu- I mean, cat. 60%. That's why they're able to do what they're say that's not a white boy? He's Asian. I mean, we never see his parents either, so... This is his voice, man. He's white. We can talk about Asian kids sound like that. White kids sound like this more. Nah. Look at him. That that's, that is a Ryan Gosling chin. That man is white. That's crazy. That's, that man Ryan is white. Gosling. He's Asian, man. You gotta see more pictures of him. All right, in the loading screen. Where do I find it? He's talking to a ball of light. <laughs> that's only a white kid does stupid shit like this. Come on, man. You get, you get. Yeah. Only a white person does stupid shit like this. Nah, Listening to balls of light outside your village? Nah. You wouldn't listen to them? No, I would go home. Nah, man. And I would tell people. Wait, <laughs> like, yeah. that's, that's the key thing we're missing here. I'm like, y'all no, they ain't gonna believe this shit. <laughs> well, when he catches you alone, he's gonna pop up again. That's ex- more reason to not listen to that. <laughs> Waiting for me to be alone. Come on, man. What y'all doing? Why this man just walking in the grass? What the fuck? I saved you. Feel safe, neighbor. The White Lotus Society was formed to protect Earthrealm from otherworldly threats. Not me. I'm a threat to society. <laughs> Come back. Because you attacked me, I will tell you nothing. Me? Nobody fights me. And and I was about to say is that you know this is the only more comic game you can, you can explore six rounds. Yeah, this is the only game where you can explore all the realms. I wish <laughs> Tekken was like that. But yeah, man, I want to explore... Like, I would like to explore Jin's village or uh, the Mishima household. He's in Japan. Yeah, that, that's cool. I want to see more. Of Japan? Yeah. <laughs> like, it's not like it's a fictional world. There's only so much you can do. I mean, but it's a fictional household. Is it? The Mishima? What, what household? Mishima's household. There is no Mishima's household. The dojo? Nope. You can fight there. That's exploring it. But I want to see. With all due respect, now maybe this game does more. Mm-hmm. If this is Overrealm, they make it look trash. Really? <laughs> yeah. No. Bunch of huts and a bridge. I mean, it is China. Bunch? Nah, China don't look like this. <laughs> I can tell you that right now. Well, they kind of. It's what like the a. F- the infrastructure. It's like a mix of Japan and China. Where the hell is the roads? They were here. Dirt roads. See? Why is well, nobody well, using them? Well, well first of all, it's not the modern times. See? Look at that man. His back broke. Careful, stranger. The Brotherhood of Shadow might get you. <laughs> what? You are the one I was warned about. I must not speak with you. Oh, 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 the old man! Okay, <laughs> hold up! Hold up! Give that man his respect, though. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't expect much out of him, but he ate two of them. It took, it took him a while, but he ate two of them. You gotta respect it. His oh, core was shit. engaged. That man took two of them. No, you gotta help him up. Now, he deserved that. He deserved to get helped up. Dog. You know what? Get sucker punched two times in the jaw like that and stand your ground. You can't do it. I guarantee you can't do it. Come on, nah, but yeah, gotta at least learn that man's name. Yeah, the Brotherhood of Shadow. He said, "I." Good day. Yeah, oh, for me at least. I keep Come on, man. He, he did stand his ground. I get the Oh man. man. See, look, he only took one. <laughs> the old man had bad back, and he could only take one. Oh, oh man. Hey, man. Give him, give him a coin or something. No, <laughs> give him a coin. Let me drop one. God oh, damn. Speed, man. Damn. God I hope he wakes up, man. He earned that. No, he wake up. He earned that months. nap. It's getting nighttime. He needs, <laughs> he needs to sleep. The rain pouring on him. Good rest. Good rest. That's, that's he said crazy. Give him a, he's silly. He said give him a coin or something. Oh, man. That man ate them. Wow. I'm gonna be honest. If he was, if he was in his prime, <laughs> you lucky that man was not in his prime. No, for real. Dude, he would have swung back. <laughs> Shujinko would have been in trouble. <laughs> he 
He at least would have blocked. <laughs> Hell yeah, like that other dude. Oh man. Okay. Well, I think let's become adult Shujinko real quick, and then we can uh, wrap this up here. Okay, so the name is familiar. Is he in the new Mortal Kombat as like the assist? Mm-hmm. He's the old man that looks like Shang Tsung. He's the old. Yeah, he like copies people. Yep. I am honored, Master Go Raicho. He's Asian. My most promising students here at my home, away from prying eyes, to assure that my secrets. Is Bo Rai Chow a pet? Nah, he's about to say that. <laughs> that sounded shady. I'm <laughs> just saying. I keep my students away from prying eyes. <laughs> my most promising? Nah. That's crazy. That's. That ain't it. And I'll be like, nah, I'm cool. But I mean, he wants to save the world, man. Cut him some slack. He's all right. Bless, Bless you. Arigato. Arigato. <laughs> and that alternate color, Brach, looks looks fantastic. Yeah. I do like the purple. Purple is better. We need yeah. to learn from that old bear. That's what we need to learn from. We should be training. I think this costume is much better for him. The garments he has on, yeah, the board, or the, whatever this called. See, I mean, fat characters aren't aren't bad, man. It's just the sloppy fat characters. You can be sloppy fat. Demanding this man literally throws up on the ground. How is he not sloppy? I mean, well, it's not sloppy. Well, Barcho, he's based on a, like a drunken master. Yeah, that's why he threw it. he's not sloppy in that regard. He's definitely still sloppy, even if he's doing drunken mastery. It's literally a sloppy fighting style. Dude. That's not bad. Stop. Right. <laughs> supposed to make him slip. Lei Wu Long don't be thrown up. Well, Lei Wu Long, he needs to learn how to throw up then. <laughs> I mean, he was a young man when he fought, to be fair. When he gets older, I think Lei Wu Long will be thrown up. That's another character I want to learn about. Lei Wu Long is uh, absolutely interesting. Like, I want What's to interesting about him? He's a cop. And he fights crime like right, that. Done here. No, he, he, <laughs> we're done here. He fights, he fights crime like well, that. That's the end of the video, folks. No, it's not. <laughs> Lei Wu Long, bro. He fights crime and he... he uh, is Striker interesting? In the newer games. How? I mean, he, he's with Cabal and he fights crime with a pistol against supernatural beings. He's badass. You gotta admit that, man. No, I don't. He's fighting supernatural beings with a pistol, bro. So does Johnny Cage. But he has powers, like green stuff. Not originally. Hey, that man was just a movie star. I mean, you know, the striker was cool, bro. Yeah. And How he, many fighting styles does this nigga got? Three. Everybody has three. You know what I don't like about the older Mortal Kombat is this this sh right here. What's that? Instead of having three fighting styles for each character, we could have had three damn characters. But we had a lot of characters. Yeah, we could have three times as many. Nah, if you think but, about it. But you want to have in-depth characters. You don't just want to have characters. Just develop the single fighting style more. When I think of Bo Rai Chow, I do not think of a damn sumo wrestler. Really? No, I think of him throwing up. So they need to focus on drunken fists. What do they do? But so they, like this shit, this jujitsu? Nah. Didn't need it. This is weapon. Nope. Th come on, man. This, <clears throat> this one makes MP4. <clears throat> they have weapons. <clears throat> His Jojutsu. No, 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 no. no. You think of Soul Calibur? I mean, Mortal Soul Calibur is known for weapons. You gotta give him that. Listen, man, I'm just saying. That, how many times is this fat <laughs> gonna fight this fat? <laughs> I mean, well, that's we're almost done. That's so important about Mortal Kombat is that it, it was such a unique idea to have weapons for all yeah, the characters. Yeah, it's a unique idea, man. You gotta give them that because they took it out. They don't have it again. It adds a variety to the game. Yeah, variety, man. That's something Tekken should do. Right. They do, actually. People are starting to use more stuff now. Like, Nina has guns and crap. Yeah, see, that's cool. I don't like it personally. Come on, man. At least in Tekken's case, because Tekken is very high on like they have specific martial arts. 
when you like start adding in the goofy stuff, it's like okay, well. But they've always been like adding goofy stuff though. No, uh, I don't think so. Like from a character perspective, yes. Yeah. So like you got a kangaroo and a baby kangaroo fighting, but like they still had like a fighting style, you know. I mean. Uh... It's just that when I'm thinking about a game that uses martial arts, I don't have that game anymore, you know? Really? Yeah, now we got, like, devils flying in the air, Eddie summoning his ancestors to help him fight. It's just like, I mean, it's cool, I guess, but, but where's the martial arts? But Tekken always had this supernatural aspect to it, though, with uh, Jin and Kazuya. But Kazuya. not the anime style, you know? Where it's like... I don't know if you've seen like recent Tekken gameplay. Like Jin does not fight like he knows martial arts anymore. Now he's just like using powers and he's fighting like an X Men character. It's like damn. I mean, but he's you from Marvel. He's kind of always been like that though. Nah, in Tekken three, people didn't start going off the rails until like Tekken six. Not Tekken five. I see. Tekken five a little bit because they start adding ninjas. And shit. Which is interesting. Like the cartoon ninjas. Like Konamitsu and Yoshimitsu were like realistic ninjas. Yeah. Raven's like cartoon ninja. You think so? Yeah, like he disappears. Well, I guess Yoshimitsu does too, but he like does the more cartoonish version, I feel. I mean, what about the soul blade that Yoshimitsu has? What do you mean? Like his, his sword has powers. Sure. So That's I mean, like Japanese mythology. Oh, ah, yeah, you are. Right. Yeah, Barrett's gameplay is much improved over Deadly Lines. Yeah, but I mean, Tekken having powers, I mean, they already kind of have that, so I'm not mad. There he is, he becomes a young Asian man. There's no way that's an Asian man. He's Asian, look at him. Nah. Low key, he look like a different person from the left <laughs> to the middle, I'm not gonna lie to you. Because in the middle, he looks more Asian, but. That's crazy. I mean, it's five years of past. He's, he's, that man's been beating Bo Raicho's ass this whole time, and he had to wait five years? Yeah, man, you gotta be trained on the arts. Stubborn ass. You gotta understand, man. You know, you, I must be master. You stay mm -hmm. five years. You Away beat from the, prying eyes. You right? <laughs> you 18 soon? Congratulations, Shuchiko. See? You, you gotta... have completed your training. It has always amazed me how quickly you learn. He looked more Asian here, I'll give him that. See? He's growing in his features, man. I think you're right. I'll give you that. Why he's standing like that, though? He's buff. He's been lifting. I'm grateful for your kind words, Master. And I am grateful for all that you have taught me. You have learned much as my pupil, but my training can only take you so far. Experience is the ultimate teacher. To further your training, you must venture into the world. Through your journeys in this realm and others, you will attain enlightenment. May I suggest, for your first adventure, that you help me find my warrior's medallion. Yeah, well, I like my bark on this game that he has a beard under his well, chin. Yeah. I will help search That's what's medallion. missing in Deadly Lions. May I ask where you saw it last? I seem to recall having it a few nights ago at the docks. Perhaps you can begin your search there. I will stay here and look around the house. Farewell, Shujinko, and good luck. Farewell, Master Boracho. Well, all right, guys, we're going to take a pause right here. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in to MK Deception Part 1. Uh, coming up next, we'll do the uh, Part 2. Oh, who's... Uh -huh. Leave that kid alone! Leave that kid alone! He's a thief! Damn. He See, was. Lockpick to us. I don't trust anybody that walks like that. Good shit, shit. Damn! Come back. Oh, he cut him off! He cut him off! Broke his ankles! Nah, he ain't that fast. Shujinko's too good. Well, uh, so we're gonna pick up where we left off from here. Oh, what's up, what's up, dude? How you doing? It is well known that the Lin Kuei and Shirai Ryu ninja clans are ancient rivals. Bitch, you better pronounce that right. It's the Shirai Ryu. I thought it was Shirai, Shirai Ryu. Shir Shiri Ryu. Shiri Ryu. Yeah, that. My bad. Damn, now nah, I gotta get punched. There you go. He took one for you. I want that old man back, man. That man was... Let's go pay him a visit. See where he's at. He's still asleep. Oh, yeah. I, oh, yeah. I was, I was about to say is that I'm also going to continue part two of 
Shalom Monks, right? Oh, yeah, 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 that too. We're going to continue part two of that. Let's go pay that old man a visit. And, and as well as Halo. Like There's a lot of part twos on the horizon, folks. Yes, indeed. Hey, Grandpa, where you at? He must have been asleep. Let me meditate. Oh, there he is. Say the same thing one or three times. You ask too many questions. Well, after uh Man, he's old man. Leave him alone. If I were younger, I would break you in half. <laughs> what did I tell you? If he was in his prime, if he was in his prime. You wouldn't be talking like that. I mean, you know. I and you gotta admit, it's five years later. He's not as tough as he was five years ago. <laughs> he took one. Got and you a young man now. You ain't a little kid. <laughs> <laughs> you got a little bit more power in your punches. <laughs> well, Ooh, I'm with you, old man. And we, we're gonna stop it right here over the old man. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Was that an eagle? Yeah. How is this man a patriot? <laughs> <laughs> Post it up like that. All right, go ahead and sign gamer. us out. DJ the Gamer signing out. Peace, y'all. Yep, peace out, everybody, and thanks for watching. And stay safe, stay real. Stay hard! <laughs>